Uh, Milan Kuchan, what Milan Kuchan did with my voice, I finished to complete that, very important. Uh, Milan Kuchan uh, had actors uh, suggest me that uh, he, that uh, he had actor, okay, man, whoever played or whoever played, whatever the use, silicon mask or whatever, already when I was adult. I don't know what the year was. What is it? Maybe 2000, whatever you did. Uh, using an actor saying to me that, uh, as Josip Brostito saying to me, that he will do this, let's do this, we will go to Novo Mesto, and I will do this for you, so that you can go on your way, you can take your people your way. Uh, and I said to Guy, uh, what are you going to do? And uh, he said, I am going to go, are you going to, I'm going to go to Belgrade. So I said, so you're not going to go with us. You're not going to be with us, the man who played Josip Brostito. This was not even 2000. This was probably 2010. Uh, and they did shit on a several occasions, which completely misinterpretates, just like the Serbian documentaries, and bullshit they try to load me with to cover up the truth. Completely, completely uh, covers up the truth with oblivious lie. Tito hated me. What I have stated to you, Tito did not only state against me in Bela Krajina and in Novo Mesto, he repeated his shit also in Slovenia, in Kran, and also in Ljubljana. The people that were around him, this man fucking hated me. It is, but the more I was growing, uh, the more Tito and I had absolutely anything in common. What started with the lies grew simply into total hatred while I still recognizing one, one as uh, seeing one as my friend less and less. Seeing him, seeing also him straight in the face for what he was, a liar, enemy. Suppose this. I did rate him as enemy. Rating Josef, Josef Bros Tito's enemy, however, was a 100% death sentence. If you did something like this, you were, you were not even sent to uh, to to a psychiatric hospital. They would probably put you against the wall and shoot you. Um, I don't know. I don't even imagine because it was such a brutal country that uh, people from the time it was this trap known as Yugoslavia understand basically exactly what I am saying. Uh, what that would be like. I was tactical enough to survive many psychopaths because there's no other way because psychopaths were involved in it psychopaths don't take no fucking responsibilities for their mistakes because there is no mistakes they don't make any mistakes um They did not rehearse this stuff once, not twice, not three, four, five. Probably ten times they were trying to convince me that Josip Bros Tito will state something like this uh, for my benefit. Like, let's now let's go to Novo Mesto, and I am going to do also that for you. And when I was asking him what was that for you, he would be like indi directly indicating like in that sense that so you're going to take your people uh, so basically western part of Yugoslavia on uh, in your own direction uh, even suggested me that they they meaning the Serbs made mistakes <laughs> that's bullshit Tito never had any good intention for anybody other than for the Serbs uh, he was committed Chetnik he had many offers to settle and in Sarajevo. Uh, Sarajevo was something claimed that it was too late, but on the other hand, 
it was what did not fit uh, Serbian Chetniks at all. They had the different plans for the Sarajevo. Uh, based on my memory since early childhood, I can tell you that Kosovo was number one problem. The second to the Kosovo was Bosnia and Herzegovina, that is a Muslim religion. I know the fuck from the first hand. I know Chetniks when they communicated with the Tito in front of me what they were discussing about. The number one problem was Kosovo, which Serbs have used to gesture him that it's his fault. And the number two problem was Bosnia. And Josip Broz Tito was drowning in his what he admitted even uh, is mistakes. It was not that he shouldn't have done that and he shouldn't have done that. That one in Kosovo is too late, but Bosnia. It never was any Sarajevo because the Sarajevo would be if he would kill all the Bosnian people, basically. And then he would be Sarajevo. Maybe even Zagreb or maybe even Ljubljana then, no problem. He was committed to the Serbian. That's it. That's all there is to it. Thanks for watching this video. Till next time.